What many people don't know is that the ocean provides most of the oxygen in the atmosphere and also to take a part of the CO2 concentration in the atmosphere, which is very important for the climate change. So the ocean plays an essential role in our life. I'm a marine biologist working on, uh, on ecology and biotechnology, and we are looking at the role of microbes in aquatic ecosystems. We are looking at the different UV filters which are included in sunscreens, and we look at the effect of these molecules one by one on the coral and the invertebrate, but also on the algae. And we try to understand which of these molecules should be removed from the formulations in general, because they are toxic. We started to have some collaboration with the PR Fab company, with the Avin products, to have a look at the different UV filters that they use. As soon as we find some results who demonstrate, for example, any toxicity in marine organisms, they try to remove as soon as possible this UV filter. It's been 10 years now that we have been working along with our research to address and to develop products that are very efficient with a high photo protection while having a minimum impact on the environment. Gavin's commitment is skin protect ocean respect. And for that we developed sunscreen by minimizing the number of UV filters and also their concentration. And we are using non-hydrosoluble UV filters. We have proof of non-ecotoxicity on three species of corals, phytoplankton and zooplankton, with no compromise on sun protection efficacy. Corals are really endangered. In only 30 years, 30% 30 of the coral reefs have been irreversibly destroyed. In 2016, we were looking for a partnership in order to contribute to the reduction of our environmental footprint. At that time, we were introduced to Pure Projet, who were carrying out the Pure Corail project. Coral reefs are often referred to as the rainforest of the oceans. They cover a tiny part of our Earth, less than 1%, but are home to over a quarter of marine life. This represents over a million different species. If the corals disappear, then the whole life associated with the corals will disappear as well. Bali is located in the Coral Triangle, which is the area we would find the highest biodiversity of corals in the world. When I went to Bali for the first time to the project site, well, I didn't see any of that. And so the project we then set up with the community there was to restore the coral reefs by building an artificial reef. We have now sunk a total of 80 structures with 9,000 corals transplanted and the area is covering a total of 3 hectares. It's great to see that even the biodiversity on top of the corals have come back already so we can now see a great diversity of fish that are calling the artificial reef their home. Aven is committed to reduce the negative impacts that sunscreens have on the environment. So the project goes hand in hand with this commitment. PFAB Laboratory's motto is taking care of living better. And I think that with this Skin Protect Ocean Respect project, it's not only a thought, it's really concrete.